Anyway, it's time for me to tell you the top news going on this week on Broadway. Let's start with the smash finale. I won't be giving away any spoilers, but the two-hour season and series finale aired on Sunday, May 26th. Without giving any spoilers, I will say it covered the Tony Awards and featured many Broadway guest stars. In addition to series regulars Megan Hilty, Jeremy Jordan, Christian Borrell, and Bernadette Peters, all from Broadway, Rosie O'Donnell, Ron Rifkin, and Cheyenne Jackson continue to bring Broadway to the small screen. Those of you who missed the two-hour series finale can catch it on NBC.com. Smash first premiered back in February 2012 and throughout its run included Broadway appearances by Norbert Leo Butts, Nick Jonas, Tom Kidd, and Lin-Manuel Miranda, just to name a few. Though the show hasn't been such a smash in ratings over the past two years, I think most Broadway fans can agree it was wonderful to see our favorites from the stage on our screens. We wish the best of luck to everyone that was involved in Smash and hope this means we can see some of our favorites return to the Great White Way. Hollywood legend Tom Hanks is now a Broadway legend as well. His caricature portrait was hung at Sardi's last week. Sardi's, located in the heart of Broadway, is known for its caricatures of Broadway actors and actresses. Hanks joined the ranks of his wife, Rita Wilson, as well as Paul Rudd, Nathan Lane, Angela Lansbury, and Patti Lapone. Hanks made his Broadway debut this season in Lucky Guy and is nominated for a Tony Award. They may not be up for the Best Actress Tony, but the four wonderfully talented little girls who portray Matilda will be honored prior to the Tony ceremony. It was announced this week that on Saturday, June 8th, the four girls who alternate starring in the musical Matilda will receive a Tony honor for excellence in theater. Additional honorees include Broadway literary agent William Craver, stage manager and associate director Peter Lawrence, and career transition for dancers. The Huntington Theater Company will receive the Regional Theater Award. The Gershwin Theater is getting a bit more wicked with two more cast members joining the company this week. Lindsay Mendez, who made her Broadway debut as Jan in Greece and has been seen in the 2011 revival of Godspell, will be turning green to play leading lady Alphaba beginning Tuesday, May 28th. Derek Kleena, new to the Broadway stage, will be taking on the role of Fierro on that same day. The two co-starred in the off-Broadway musical Dogfight. After months of hearing news of Broadway's newest shows this season, it's officially time to hear the soundtracks. What else could I do? Though the Cinderella soundtrack has already been released, this Tuesday, May 28th, the cast recordings of Annie, Kinky Boots, and Murder Ballad are all available for digital download. Though not available yet, we've seen the cast of Pippin and the Last Five Years, among some others, in the studio recently, so be on the lookout for more albums this summer. Eventually, not like it's in my control, not like I'm proud. Thanks so much for watching, and be sure to tune in on Thursday for the latest going on on Broadway.